Now, back in January of 2015, did you ever learn about strike that? Do you know someone um, that goes by the name of Lucci? Who? Lucci. A rapper by the name of YFN Lucci. What about him? Do you know an individual by the name of YFN Lucci? I don't know a person. Okay. Have you ever met this individual? You say, have I ever met him? Yes. Nope. When you say you don't know him personally, what do you mean? Because you say, have you ever met? I know we never shook hands. I never met him. Okay. How would you describe knowing YFN Lucci? Uh, he's a rapper. Okay. Do you know him outside of being a rapper? No. Okay. In 2015, were you aware of his mother's home being shot shot at twice after twice, excuse me? You're shaking your head. I don't know nothing about him. Okay. Do you recall in this January interview with Detective Gaither and Detective Dennis talking to them about Lucci's house, Lucci's mother's house being shot at? I don't remember. Okay. I don't recall. Do you recall telling Detective Gage and Detective Dennis that people thought that you shot up Lucci's mother's house? I don't know nothing about it. Okay. Do you recall in this same interview back in January of 2015 with Gaither and Dennis that you were with Big Boo when Lucci's manager called trying to find out who shot up Lucci's mother's house? I don't recall. And do you recall during this same interview telling Detective Gaither that when the manager called Big Boo, you were present and overheard the conversation? I don't recall. And in the same interview, you told Detective Gaither that the manager told Big Boo that he had $20,000 for whoever killed or excuse me, shot at Lucy Mother's house. I don't know nothing about it. Okay. And that you actually took the phone from Big Boo and told them that you had nothing to do with shooting up Lucy's mother's house. Okay. Okay. Do you remember telling the detectives about well, that? I don't recall. Did that occur? I don't know. You don't know if you were present with Big Boo and took the phone away from him? I don't know what y'all talking about. Why would you need to tell Detective Gates and Detective Dennis that if that did not occur? Because these things I'm hearing in the street, so I got, I'm trying to convince them to get off of me. Specifically, didn't you tell Detective Gaither that when you took the phone, you said, man, I ain't did nothing like that, bro. You know, don't scream my name. I ain't got nothing to do with it. I ain't said he did. I ain't do that. I don't care about none of that. I didn't do that. I don't recall. And did you actually tell Detective Gage and Detective Dennis that you were concerned because you thought that Boo was going to set you up and tell people that you shot Lucy so he can get the $20,000. Huh? Did you, in the same interview, tell Detective Gaither and Detective Dennis that you thought Boo would have set you up and told people you shot at Lucy Mother's house to get the $20,000? I don't know nothing about that. Okay. I don't recall. And after that phone call that with Big Boo, you were so upset that you had Monk to take you home because of that phone call. I don't I don't know. I don't recall.
And you also told Detective Gaither that when you got into the car with Moonsoon after this phone call, you told Detective, you told Moonsoon, boo tripping, boo going to try to get, you know what I'm saying? And Moonsoon said, we got to stay away from them. No, nah, I don't recall. I supposed to be saying this stuff? Yes. Oh, no. Nah. And were you the only person in the interview room with Gaither and Dennis based on those pictures that are in front of you? I was the only person in the room when I was telling you I made these lies up, too. Okay. 